Good morning, hot dogs. And welcome to the morning announcements. Today we'll be covering marching band practice, crash, and more. Now, on to the pledge. Please stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Marching band practice will be held on Tuesday and Thursday of this week. It starts at 4 o'clock and it's not too late to join. We have a second drawing for a mental health awareness t-shirt and the winner is... Stephanie Aguilar, you can claim your prize in student services. Mrs. Hale is busy trying to get the library organized and ready for normal use next school year. She has passed out a lot of notices of items that are currently missing. Please bring them back ASAP to avoid having to pay to replace them. If you no longer have the item, please see Mrs. Hale in the Media Center. She will give you an amount that it will cost to replace the item. You must pay Mrs. Cheek in the bookstore by cash, check to the Community Schools of Frankfurt, or by credit card. Let's work hard to locate those items and get them turned in. Graduation is coming up, and if you or someone you know might be interested in purchasing graduation gifts or a bouquet of flowers for your FHS graduate, you can check the link in the chatter. Now to sports and weather. Good morning, hot dogs. The girls and boys track and field teams competed at well at the SAC championship meet on Friday. Both teams had a lot of new PRs and scored in every single event except two. The girls team finished third place in the conference. Top three finishers include Macy Starrett, second in the 100 hurdles, Karina Alanis, third in the 1600, and third in the 3200, Kenya Garcia second in the discus and Lorena Perez second in the high jump and third in the long jump. With their second place finishes, Macy, Kenya, and Lorena are second team all conference. The boys team finished fifth in the conference, improving from eighth place at the last meet two years ago. Top three finishers include San Michael third in the 100, Angel Perez third in the 1600, and third in the 800, Wills, Mullinex, Burns, and Michael third in the 4x100, and Kyle Earl third in the shot put. Hot Dog Golfers posted a season best 18 hole score of 398 to play 7th in the Sagamore Conference Tourney at Rocky Ridge Golf Course Saturday. The Dogs led by all conference team member Reese Mitchell 93, Dakota Bailey 94, Ramsey Mitchell 101, Jesse Reed 115 endured the slow 5.5 round caused by the slow pay of a group and the flight ahead of them. Hot Dogs host West Lafayette and McCutcheon at home on Thursday this week. Girls Tennis lost to Southmont 5-0 on Friday night. On Saturday, the team finished last in the 2021 Hot Dog Invitations. In the first round, Frankfurt lost to Carroll 4-1. Raylan Mitchell got the win for the Dogs. Frankfurt played Yorktown in the Constellation match and lost 4-1. Carly Santos got the win for the Hot Dogs. Girls Tennis plays at McCutcheon today to finish out the regular season. There will be a call-out meeting for anyone interested in playing boys soccer next fall this, this Thursday morning at 7.30 in room 105. See Mr. Brother if you're not able to attend the meeting. There will be a cross-country call-out meeting on Tuesday, May 18, at 7.30 a.m. during community in room 403 for anyone who's interested in running cross-country next year, next fall. Anyways, that's all for sports. Now to us to send over weather. Good morning, hot dogs. There is cons considerable cloudiness with a occasional rain shower. There will be a high city 67 and low 58 degrees. Winds will be at 10 to 20 miles per hour. It will be pretty cloudy with six showers and there is a 50% chance of rain. That's it for weather and I'm back to your host. Please fill out the Google form sent by Mrs. McDonald to nominate yourself or your classmates for prom royalty. Seniors will nominate for prom, prom queen and king and juniors will nominate for prom princess and prince. This Google Forum will close on Friday, May 21st. The World War I program took place last Friday. There was a wreath laying ceremony, a Tomb of the Unknown Soldier replica for the Korean War, Vietnam War, and World War II. There was also a full Tomb of the Unknown Soldier replica display. The last crash meeting is May 20th at 3.30 p.m. at the Prairie Creek Park. There will be awards, pizza, and ice cream. All members who RSVP'd are invited to celebrate this meeting. 
Happy birthday goes out to Jennifer Cruz Cavito, Jasmine Longoria, Ivana Lopez, Christian Mejia Mora, and Edwin Mejia Mora. Have a marvelous day, guys. For lunch today, lines one and two is General So, and lines three and four, grilled cheese, and all lines will have chef salads and yogurt. That's all for the announcements, hot dogs. Like, share, and subscribe. And there's only seven days left of school.